This close to Christmas and business is normally booming for shops and traders in Brussels. But the security measures in place amid a terror alert has hit the revenues of local firms. Ivan Meyer is the mayor of the Belgian capital. We know, of course, that Brussels is also about quality of life, about the joy of living, a certain kind of humour which is very typical for Brussels. The soldier in front of a building should not remain the image of Brussels. The city's metro network will only reopen on Wednesday. The streets have not been totally deserted, but that move has hampered the ability of locals and tourists alike to get out and shop. Industry worries about what people elsewhere will think. I think even the Minister of Foreign Affairs has already spoken about repolishing the image of Brussels and of Belgium abroad. Employees say they want the terror threat level to be reduced as soon as possible. In Brussels, it's at four until Monday, the highest possible level. The longer the situation lasts, the worse it is for business. People are not coming, firstly because they're being talked out of coming. But even when the security measures are lifted, there'll be a kind of trauma in people's heads. It will depend on the continuity of the presence of the police and military, because I think that scares some people off. But I'm convinced in two to three weeks life will be back to normal. Whilst it's too early to give precise figures, economists say the losses for the Brussels economy and for Belgium will run into several millions of euros.